this is what the client wanted, a fence using the sort of panel. So the first thing we did, we went to a website. We found the manufacturer of the, of the panels. We managed to get a photograph that looked like the panels. We found out about creating the panels. Then we went back to create a object that we could reuse. So this is a frame with a panel. We had to make a texture. So we got the image, straightened it all up in Photoshop, brought it into Vectorworks, made a texture, got it the right size, created a bump map to go with it, put it inside a panel. We then made this into a symbol so that we could reuse it again and again. There it is there. And that panel we then put into a fence. So now we have a fence with a fence style, which will recreate this panelized fence system, which is really cool. You can see VectorX has chopped that panel off where it needed to, and we used the fence object to create this customized panel. So here's that same fence in a site model. You can see it's now stepping up, and we have created the fence system that we need. So that was our 3D modeling special interest group today. That was the webinar that I did today, and those are the things that we went through. So thanks for watching. Now, if you'd like to come to these webinars, become a subscriber. Subscribers to my website get access to these, plus you can attend the meetings, and you can be the one that asks the questions and gets the solutions. So thanks for watching.